not even 24 hours after part one um i'm here to record part two <laughs> hi i'm camila Chu, and we are back playing inscription for the part two to set it up in love with this game is an understatement and i did my very best to wait as long as i could after part one's release with playing part two because i really wanted you guys to be part of the interaction in the matter of you give me some tips or tell me what not what to do but you know give me some feedback get excited for part two and see if i listen to some of this stuff and you know i've been replying i've been reading i see you guys you've been helping me but i i couldn't wait it's been yeah not even 24 hours and he works because I, I couldn't wait to play so we did we did uh oh wait all right i have to remember buttons we d oh i hate i can see his face a little bit mm, i hate it mm. we did win the first boss battle the prospector i believe we got the stink bug card yeah sorry my pants are annoying me ah! but we did the first one and we just entered the wetlands and i got some tips not non-spoiling tips because i am open for non-spoiling tips that why is there no light here weren't there an item that before that it's okay to snoop around the house because i was scared to touch anything because people or because the dude said don't touch my stuff i was scared so i didn't dare touch anything but some of you told me i could rest assured touch some of his stuff he just he's just gonna have to live with it so now i'm a bit more <laughs> scared even away that he stares at me why is there only one candle lit <laughs> is that gonna have any effect oh that was dumb oh what if that was what if that was my life Let's play the wetlands. We're here. We're here. Okay. Yes, yes. First one. Oh, we got our own death card. That's true. You arrived at the inky black mouth of a cave. <laughs> a strange beast lurked within. It spoke. Pass one of my trials and I will be yours. In a raspy voice. How the hell do you do a raspy voice? I need to scream or yell to get that. Three creatures will be drawn from your deck. They will decide your success or your... F I accidentally click fail, I guess. It spoke again. But first you will choose a trial. How do I do that raspy? I can't do that. But first you will choose a trial. Okay. The trial of wisdom. The three drawn cards... M the trial of wisdom. The, the three draw drawn cards must have at least three sigils among them to pass. The trial of bones. The three drawn cards must at oh, cost at least five bones combined. I don't have that many bones cards. The trial of blood. The three drawn cards must cost at least four blood combined to pass. I have a feeling the blood one would be the smartest. Yeah. So we have a few expensive drawn blood thingies and it is three cards. So it's just like two wolves and then we're there. Let the trial of blood begin. Uh oh. Two. <laughs> I wouldn't no, honestly no matter what I've chosen, I wouldn't have gotten it. But I got three zero from the possum, two from the adder, one from the stout. Stort. Stort? Stout? Stout. You I asked you stout. Yes, yeah, stout. Good luck. Failure, the creature whispered as it faded into the blackness. Okay, so if I find the cave again, I can try and then it might join my team. Okay, so backpack to get items. Can I check my inventory? Like, I can, of course, check the table. I currently only have the, the fan thing. What is that one? The cross or like the X? I know what that is, but that's a boss battle. We're gonna need the items. Piggy's gonna be good. Squirrel. Yeah. I don't remember my course too well, so we're just gonna have to wing it. <laughs> Let's go, sir! Just... Yeah! All right, we did the gek! And I was like, I don't know why it was like one like a rare card. And this, the, 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 the text was like, you don't know what's special about this gek. Maybe you can use it for something. So I chose it with the thought of we might get something later on we can use to like evolve it or something, you know? 
but we got the we can't pull cards so i have to re remember stuff but we have to squirrel so put squirrel down and stone we can check what he oh, spider kingfisher wait what airborne a card bearing the sigil will strike an opponent directly even if there's a creature opposing it but what does the what does the tail waterborne a card bearing the sigil submerges itself during the opponent's turn while being submerged opposing creatures attack its own directly okay so i cannot these two i cannot get rid of it would seem unless i have like some special card that doesn't care about it actually being able to both dive and fly Ooh, oh good start beehive once a card bearing the sigil is struck a bee is created in your hand a bee is defined as one power one health okay so if i attack the beehive if i ignore if i if i focus on ignoring the beehive i shouldn't give them any wasp cards so i should focus on attacking these themses here and then have squirrel cards and blood cards over there in the future okay let's do this Haya. i can't attack those either way so i might as well put this dude no i need a stronger one there yeah you sure yeah I, I i can't regret you know so it's, it's not really a choice. Ding, bang, a tooth. And now they're all played. Ow, ow. And now, yeah, so now I can't hit them. But, and I I, I need to, I, 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 uh, 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 screw, I didn't mean that. Uh oh. Wait, six, rattler. Two, four, five. Five, can I just place this one? The gek? Awesome is two bones, right? It's only a one one. So if I wait, wait, I use a squirrel. Put squirrel down. Can I sacrifice the squirrel now, or do I have to wait around? I think I need to wait around because I need something to like the squirrel before I can, you know. He's impatient. Oh gosh. Uh, brain. <sighs> one two one. That's a bad uh, thing. Huh? How can they wait? How can they play a, a river otter? A card bearing the sigil submerged if during the opponent's turn while being submerged opposed to creature attack as one directly. How how can they play that card then with that oh they sacrifice? They're gonna oh they're gonna sacrifice one of these cards to get this one up, but that's in my favor. Because they're not gonna wee across, so I'm gonna bloop underneath. That's in my favor. Bah! Okay, now I need to smart. I need to end this one. So I need to draw me. And to get me there and there. Play me there. Go back. Do the rattler there. Yeah? Because now we have, like, a lot of attack from me. And I am both. I, I, I can't be sacrificed. And there was something else. What was it? Yeah, it doesn't perish. Yeah, 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 yeah. And we have to stout. Let's do it. And the rattler. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We got this. Ding, ding, ding. Bang, bang, bang. Are you serious? Oh! And I also have to focus on the pelts if I wanted to. So whenever they forfeit, forfeit, right? Forfeit. I should keep going. Because the add extra damage I give at the end of each round, I would get bones for. I could buy pelts for. Was that how it was? Right? Okay, let's see. Casey. River Snapper and Beehive. The invaluable beehive. When it is attacked, you will draw a bee. That is not a bad card. What about this one? A card bearing the sigil will strike each opposing space to the left and right of the space across from it. Once a card bearing the sigil is struck, the striker is then dealt a single damage point. That means they this card will deal one attack to the two next of it, but if it gets an attack, I will also get two attacks or two ouchies. Right? I'm gonna try. That sounds... It's like high risk, high reward kind of thing. And this was upgrade. This was a bonfire thing. And more items. I kind of want to upgrade the stout. Or like... Sacrifice to upgrade stout, right? The choice is yours. So sacrifice... Bullfrog, I think. 
four. I'll go. Yeah, for stuff. I don't know why I'm trusting this dude. What? All right. Uh, yeah, all right. Yeah, so we we sacrificed the bullfrog's abilities to give to Stout. So he's cool as if now. And now we have a mini boss battle, and the other one was like a totem battle. Yay! Oh, look how cool he is. Let's put out the squirrel. Uh, do you need a bone? Do you need two blood and stout? Sto wait, 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 wait. Bullfrog. What did the bullfrog do again? A card bearing decision block. Oh, that's the page thing. Uh, will block opposing creature bearing the or A card bearing this sigil will block in an oppose. Oh, so this can block airborne creatures. I don't have any of those, but you do have one attack, right? Yes, you do. So, sacrifice that to place there. Bad place. Why is he always doubting me? Why? Why is he always doubting me? I need a squirrel to play. And it's got a heart. I need the adder gone a lot. Let's place this in its way. Because I, I can't do anything yet. Yeah. Ooh. 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 I will allow you to play a card before I draw one. I won't allow you. Ooh. You need two? Uh-oh. I have one, two. I'm gonna lose now. Uh-oh, oh, he's sad. Is he sad? Oh, he's, he's, oh, he's angry. <gasps> oh, what do I do? Oh, what do I do? I, I need to play something in front of the coyote. I need to take a chance. D didn't do well. Crap. I'm gonna lose now. Oh, I'm gonna lose. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm gonna lose. Because this is just... Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna lose. Crap. Yeah, lost. Big time. Big time loss. How in the world am I supposed to survive that one? Yeah, I have two lives. Can I restore lives somehow? How disappointing. I want to see what that dude is in the cave. Oh, that was a difficult one. It is a bit of a, a luck game as well. Okay. The trial, we have the blood. Four of blood at least. Trial of health. Draw this card and have at least six health combined to pass. Uh, at least three sigils. I'm going to do the blood thing again. I don't think I have, yeah, a good enough chance. Oh, God. I am so unlucky. I should... I, I need to focus on the bones. I am so unlucky. Oh, God. Okay. Uh, items or fire? I have a feeling we need the items. Oh, I'm gonna lose. I need the bones. I already have that. I haven't used it once. I should never... Have That's not my thing. That one for... Yeah, I need that one. Oh god, this is not good. I have one more shot at the, the special card thing. I want it! So strange. Why can't I remember his name? I believe I lost some of my memory in the flash. The flash? Look, there is a third talking card somewhere around here. Personally, I hate the guy. Biggest killjoy ever. But he's the only one of us with a plan to get things back to normal. Okay, let's take a look here. Is airborne or airborne? Air airborne and airborne. I can't do those. I, I can't hit that one. But I can hit that one. That one's gonna hide. And if that one attacks me, that attacks as well. So it would actually be not smart to play KC. Um, I need to play the, the stoat. And then play the stoat in this dude's play. Yes, I do that. Yes. Okay, we got this. We got this. I'm gonna play the stoat there. <laughs> Stut, get back there. Yep. Agreed. Okay, he agreed. This is smart. Okay. Uh, okay, I have a squirrel I can use there. What did the stink bug do again? 
What did you do? The creature opposing card uh, loses one power. I kind of want the I want to where the coyote is then. So if I pull this, so I have a spare. Does it only cost two? But oh crap! I only effed it up. Oh, I effed it up again. And then yet not. If I play this now, that's gonna attack that this time. Instead of me. I'm, I'm gonna get a free bone, right? Unless I... Oh, no. I do play Casey. Uh, sacrifice place there. Go back. Stink bug there. Right? Good play. Yeah! Oh god, the cards are telling me I'm doing good job. Yeah, thank you. See, now this is gonna get interesting. Yeah, because that's gonna jump me anyway. So Casey being there is gonna get the Sparrow. That one's gonna get the Sparrow then. At least once. One attack. And it won't be able to get the other though. And now I have no cards. I have a spare of that guy. And I also have that. Okay, I also have bones. So, oh, me. I, I cost two blood. Let's try this first. See, now we're even. Now we're even. Oh. Stop that. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> mm. I'm considering offering Sir Stingbug. So we can get one, two blood, and we can play me. Which means I might as well pull this to see what happens. We got a rattler. Okay, that's fine. So if we take this. Play that there. I want me out. So, and me, and me. Uh, aim for this one. So that disappears. Yeah. There. Yeah. Bang, bang, bang. Oh, wait. I didn't need to do that. Casey's right there. I didn't need to do that. And then yet again, that's going to double whammy some of them. Oh. Oh, that's going to double whammy. Okay, we got the Rattler. I have nothing to sacrifice, really. Or at least I want to sacrifice mine. Let's do a wolf card and see what happens. Okay, what's gonna be played? River Otter. Hmm. That means I'm I'm gonna need to do some serious damage now. So that does two and three damage. But you need two blood. So I can if I sacrifice me. No, but then that one's gone. Because then one, two, three, four. That's gonna do some serious damage. But if I attack now, 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 and then do do do. Okay, I I need to I need to stop. Bang bang! So then we're sure it's gone. Yeah! I I need to figure out how the whole counting how many bones or how many you know nuggets are left for the way to to make you know in my favor, so I can calculate if I'm gonna win or not that turn. Because I forget to do that <laughs> a lot. Okay, let's see. Trial of power. Uh, at least four attack power to combine. Combine that one. We're gonna try. We're gonna try the attack power. Let's try the attack power, please. Three, five, a lot. Three, two, three. Yeps, you have passed the trial. And now we battle it? Or how was it? Raven egg. What the heck are these? The moose? Wait. A card bearing this sigil will grow into a more powerful form after one turn on the board. What does the wearing a card is uh, damage other creature that creature perishes? That's a special raven. Okay, the moose. When opposing creatures are placed opposite to an empty space, a card bearing this sigil will move to that empty space. Oh, so if I play a card here and they play a card here, wait. That means the card next will. So I can technically move damage from someone else to that. I think. I think. When a card bearing decision is played, a rabbit is created in your hand. Yes, a rabbit, but what does it do? Uh, once a card bearing decision is struck, the striker is then dealt a single... Oh, so if... Oh, these are good. So if the cre if, if the opponent struck the rabbit, they will receive a damage point to themselves directly. And when this ca card is played as well, I will get a rabbit in my hand. But it gets no no health, so it's basically, you know, blood. Lots of points for blood. 
I'm feeling offensive or like being attacking. Let's do. I have to. At the end of owner's turn, a card bearing the sigil will move in the direction in script in the sigil. Um, creature on the way will be pushed in the same direction. So if I place this on the far left of the board, it will push everything in the other way. But what if it can't be pushed anymore then? What then? They're just gonna. Eat. It got a lot of health. I am really headed. I am either. Because that requires a lot of blood. So I'm actually. I'm, I'm gonna go with the Raven. That sounds interesting. I haven't really used enough items, I think. So let's do the sacrifice. I know I could have used it, but at the same time, I still have two of them. I need to not get the fan again. Okay. Hello! So, sacrifice a card. I haven't used you much, but I have a feeling we need you. So, sacrifice a card. I haven't used Adder at all either, but you know what? Let's sacrifice Casey. Am I your choice? And then you get damage to both sides, but I also take damage. Meanwhile, the one in front of you also lose power. That would actually not be a dumb combination. Let's do that. Let's do that. Empower me! <laughs> Should we go? Okay, before boss battle? Before boss battle. Let's, um... Let's take a ramp. Okay, where we took... What was it? Okay, let's take a look over here. <laughs> okay, let's look. Spin! Ooh, spin! Gold tooth? What did I do with those? I stole the teeth. What did that do? As well as I blew out the candle. What did that do? That's the card we need. Because they mentioned it was a wolf card and he was like, Grr. How do I get him? Already took the teeth. I can spin this all I want. It's not going to do anything. Anything else I can do? No. I have... Uh, there's a puzzle here, right? Like... That I'm not sure I understand yet. Like, it has to be... Wait, ding? Oh, I... I have to make it five. Somehow, I'm not sure. Where, where am I supposed to count from? What is plus minus? What, what is... What, what is what here? I'm just guessing. I'm not... Bah. Wait, what? Here? Three? Bah! So it's plus minus something. Okay, everything to the bottom, everything to the bottom. One, two, three. Three, six, nine. Nine minus three is six, but it's a what? Uh, bah! Same thing. Okay, everything, everything. Is it, was that just it? The skink? I forgot that I put that there. Very well, you've added to your deck, and I, I'll deal you one every so often. And I'll deal you one every so often. What? Deal me one? What do you mean? What do you mean? Wait. I don't understand how this puzzle works. It gives zero. How does it give zero? Now it gives one. Is it the bottom one I have to account for? So, so one? No, that's still a one. And now it's a zero. Now it's a one. Would that mean two now? That Now it's a two. And then it's a one. How is it a one? That's hard. And th that one can't go down. So if I take this up, then it's a two again. This one down makes it a three. And then it's a one. Now it's one, a zero, one, zero, va. <laughs> My poor brain. <laughs> Somehow it gives two now. If I move that, then it's fine. Okay, I did it. Four little creatures, those ends. Very well, I will add them to your deck and make them available for your for future channels. Oh, so they're providing me the option of maybe getting them. More grant and the queen. More? It's because I have to give five and five on both sides? Is that No, that doesn't make sense either. That's three. That was two. That was four. One and one. Is it a matter of damage? 
So I have to pretend these are the cards. And then I have to deal five damage or have five hearts to spare. Is that how that works? Because now it gives one, which means it takes none there, one there. That's one. So that's a zero. Uh, which means it's one and one damage. One to one, right? And this one is one to that one to. Okay, so these two in both that, 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 that. So that's empty and that's empty. So that's one, one. That one takes that one then. So that's a zero. And that one takes that one, then it would be two for them. But it's a one. Okay, I don't know. Yeah, no. Saving this. Okay. Getting smarter. And there's nothing left here. We already checked the figurines out. One of you guys said nothing is as it seems. Which is why I am so super curious. Super, super curious. You haven't... Oh! Wait. Does it fit? I found the ring? Ring? Who would want the ring? Who would want a ring? It's not like there's a hand or something here, like proposal, like marry me, night, night, night. Are there more options for this dude then? So this one down here opens as well. There's got to be one. Eleven. Do we need clues to what the time would be that I haven't found? How about it? Six. Like this. Isn't it like an? No. But I need clues. Maybe maybe I'm thinking too far ahead as of now. But I found... Okay, we have found a... a four? Four, four. Four, four, what? Four, four, what? Huh. What? It could be many things. It could be four times. It could be four turns. It could be a lot of stuff. Hmm. Just looking at stuff here by the side. Okay, sorry. Let's do the thing. I just get caught up by the... the I really get caught up by the puzzles. They're so interesting to me. A foul smell invaded your nostrils and caused your throat to seize. A hulking man sat by a brackish pond with his feet submerged in the dark water. He pulled a hook from a pile of rotting fish and rose to his feet. I am the angler. Go fish. Um... If I, like, lose-lose, is it all over? Like, all game over. All over again. Is that how that works? He's gonna play the kingfisher. We're just gonna go above and underneath. So we need the stink bug there. Because that's the bullfish. Or the bullfrog. So it can't, like, push past him. And this is what we got right now. What did the reptile thing do? When a card-bearing decision will be struck, a, t uh, a tail is created in this place and a card-bearing decision moves to the right. Also, it's like it gets struck, so instead of dying, it like splits the tail, move on to the right and have a second chance. Aha! That's smart. Okay, well, we got, we got a squirrel, so might as well. And we know what I need there. It's just, it's just a matter of, am I gonna get it? You know? So I'm gonna take the chance as of now. I'm gonna take the chance. Yeah. Bang. The kingfisher is here. Kingfisher is here. Uh, bah, hook, bell, hook, hook. What does the hook mean? The angler, mind his hook. Play a squirrel or something when he aims at it. Oh no, that will protect your best cards.
Uh, where's your fish? Easy choice. Can I? Um, wait, did he steal from me? No. What did this do again? To the user, your creature will be attacked as though they have airborne sigil this tone. Turn. As though they have airborne sigil this turn. Oh, oh! Oh! Play the gag, because I don't. New fish! Okay, 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 I see, I see. Okay, I see. So now we have to start playing. Oh gosh, she has a frog. Bye, Gek. He stole it. Mine now. Go fish. Okay. I need a squirrel. But... Is he gonna do anything? Not yet. Maybe next turn. Maybe next turn. Hmm, stale fish, hard to choose. Okay, so he hasn't done anything yet. There we go, he did it. Okay, so I have a squirrel. So pull a regular card. Two blood, so play squirrel now. New fish. Take new fish, easy. And that be it. Yeah, he has two lives. I'm like, this is too easy. He's got two lives. Go fish. Bait bucket. Horse to attack. Is that it? I should have played the stink bug over here instead. Like here, so it would attack both of these and then be gone. Uh... Sacrifice the possum and the squirrel so I can get this dude out Maybe and then Yeah, do this play Adler doot doot play there Yeah Great white go fish Where did my tail go they weren't I supposed to get a tail from it? And now they're underneath. Huh? Oh, I need to I need to do something so I don't Oh, I need to fly over them. I actually need my fan. Oh no. I can't do anything but this. Oh, okay, I attacked directly. Ow 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 ow. Oh no. Uh Two, four, two, four, fingers crossed, I get what I need. Mother ant. What did I do? Uh, the value represented with the sigil will be equal to the number of ants. Oh, I don't have any. Oh, I don't have any. Oh, I am screwed. I lost. There, I lost. Yeah. Oh, I guess I'm gonna see what happens. Ah, go fish. Okay, how far am I gonna get set back? How much do I need to do over, over again? I'm not sure. This is the first time I lose, or it's not super early in game. Like, do I have, is it only the second boss that I'll lose? Or is it like, early there? Stay there, no need to move. I need to note down the time, epileptic warning. Sorry, one second. There we go. I'm afraid you are not dead yet. Hold still. Hmm, where did I put the camera of mine? I took it. Pathetic. Do you think I would leave the film in there? Do you have any idea what that camera is capable of? Give me that. Ah! 
We have a memento to create. Behold your death card. Shall we begin to ink it? Please choose a card to draw the cost from. We need cheap cost. Eat. One blood, yes. Add another, this time we'll use power and health. Power and health would be the wolf. Yeah? Now choose a card from which you will extract the sigils. Ooh. When a card bearing the sigil is planted or played, uh, an ant is created in your hand. Oh, that could be cool, making it an ant queen. But that would mean we need to have the other ants as well, so we could try and focus on an ant card. Uh, as Halo's creative and it's played. Oh, it's because struck and dead is two different things. So if it's only one. Ah. I'm. Mm. I'm actually gonna go for the ant. That sounds like dope. Yeah. I never did ask your name. All right, I'm a different one. So Camila was last, so now I am two. One thing now remains. I must capture your visage. It is. <laughs> oh, this is awful. <laughs> Okay, let's take a quick glance. Quick sneak peek. Are you prepared for what lies ahead? To be impaled on the angler's hook like the one who came before. It seems the lovely stink bug has made its way in. Why does this stoat look that weird? But it's it, but it is dealt, so it stands. Ah! This is not the same stout as before. That's not the same stout. So are we we are all the way back aren't we that's not the same style it looks weird it looks like the, the face is square not round that's not the same one even though it blinks I don't think that's the same one I'm not sure has anything been changed has anything changed as we were gone do I still have the ring what is this leaderboard now is the adder and the squirrel what is about this what is this what is it about this now the angle and the squirrel there are the adder and the squirrel why are they there do I get something special if I have them? Is that it? And play Do I get something special if I place these in this this way on the table? Squirrel and adder? Oh. I still have the ring. What did the teeth do? <laughs> like where did the teeth go? They we but who took them? Like, why, why are they there? Why is this candle lit now? What is with this candle? Psst. One, two, three. That looks like the... Wait, that looks like the ring we have... We found, like, on the... On the cage. Like... Nothing on it? Per se? Does it change? No. We still have these two to figure out as well. And I still need to figure out this. I think we're going to stop here, Eliza. I, I will have a hard time stopping. All right, I have to choose the statue as well. Let's do that real quick. Can I choose any? Or am I forced to do... Or I'm not ready yet? The game's going to be like, no, you have to choose your figure. B -b -b. So I think we're going to stop it here. We're going to stop it here. Um. So I need your help on two things. How... Does these puzzles work? How do they work? I have no clue. Th please help me on that one. Help me understand what it is that I need to do. Because I, I understand the idea. I just don't see where I'm supposed to count count what from. Yeah, that's like the big thing. So we're going to stop here. And then next time we're going to continue where we left off. And see if I manage to end the angler. Should be pretty forward to get to the angler compared to everything because you know we already did the one, so we're gonna leave it there, otherwise, I can't stop playing. So, thank you so much for watching this time. Please help me out with what I requested and answer to the best of your ability. And you just want to see me in pain, you're more than welcome to. So, stay tuned for episode th uh, three. I appreciate you. See you next time. Bye.